Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to Our Lady of Petrochem. Thank you for coming to Mass at a very early time. I know this is a little sacrifice for you. Um, before heading off to work, you would like to give priority to our Lord, especially as we begin the season of Lent. So, we are before the Blessed Sacrament. We shall pray for the following confessions. We shall pray for those who are sick. We pray for those with cancer. And we especially remember the Lord of Rosano, D. Fredson, Stephen Phoenix, Remedios Gatti, Lucia Leonard, Lucas Hernandez, Sharon Lecoyer. Um, let me see. Chito Perret. Victor Ohizon, Claudia Bravo, Chesna Rigal, Bethany Fram. Um, top, the top of my head. Um, uh, Cole, Sebastian Cole, uh, Troy Jason Durango, Daisy Hernandez, Randy Flock, Marcia Stegnaro. We also pray for the repose of the souls of our faithful departed. We shall pray for the souls of Jack Lambert and Brandon Donald. Let's all kneel. Blessed be God. Blessed be God. Blessed be His holy name. Blessed be His holy name. Blessed be Jesus Christ, true God and true man. Blessed be Jesus Christ, true God and true man. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Blessed be His most sacred heart. Blessed be his most sacred heart. Blessed be his most precious blood. Blessed be his most precious blood. Blessed be Jesus in the most holy sacrament of the altar. Blessed be Jesus in the most holy sacrament of the altar. Blessed be the Holy Spirit paraclete. Blessed be the Holy Spirit and paraclete. Blessed be the great mother of God, Mary most holy. Blessed be the great mother of God, Mary most holy. Blessed be her holy and immaculate. Blessed be her holy and immaculate conception. Blessed be her glorious assumption. Blessed be her glorious assumption. Blessed be the name of Mary, Virgin and Mother. Blessed be the name of Mary, Virgin and Mother. Blessed be Saint Joseph, her most chaste spouse. Blessed be Saint Joseph, her most chaste spouse. Blessed be God and his angels and his saints. Blessed be God and his angels and his saints. Holy God, we praise thy name. Lord of all, we bow before thee. All on earth, thy scepter claim. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. We shall honor Mary, our mother, the angel of the Lord of the Mary, and she conceived by the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, 
Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the word is made flesh. And dwelt amongst us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, the Holy Mother of God that we be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. Pour forth and beseech ye, O Lord, thy grace into our hearts, the way to whom the incarnation of Christ thy Son was made known by the message of an angel, made by his passion on the cross, be brought to the glory of his resurrection through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and, and to the Son, and, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and it shall be, world without end. Amen. Our Lady of Perpetual Help. Pray for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, and the love of God, and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. And with your spirit. We shall omit our penitential right, and instead of saying, Lord have mercy, Christ have mercy, Lord have mercy, we shall do this by receiving the ashes on our foreheads. That's our way of asking Jesus to forgive us our sins. Let us pray. Grant, O loving Father, that we may begin with holy fasting, this campaign of Christian service. So that as we take a battle against spiritual evils, we may be armed with weapons of self-restraint. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. Amen.
A reading from the second letter of St. Paul to the Corinthians. Brothers and sisters, we are ambassadors for Christ, as if God were appealing through us. We implore you on behalf of Christ, be reconciled to God. For our sake we made him to be sin who did not know sin, so that we might become the righteousness of God in him. Working together, then, we appeal to you not to receive the grace of God in vain. For he says, In an acceptable time I heard you, and on the day of salvation I helped you. Behold now is a very acceptable time. Behold now is the day of salvation. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. We shall not say the Alleluia, but we shall say, Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ, King of endless glory. Everybody say it. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ, King of endless glory. If today you hear his voice, harden not your hearts. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ, King of endless glory. And with your spirit, a reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Matthew. Glory to you, Lord. Jesus said to his disciples, Take care not to perform righteous deeds in order that people may see them. Otherwise, you will have no recompense from your heavenly Father. When you give alms, do not blow a trumpet before you as the hypocrites do in the synagogues and in the streets, to win the praise of others. Amen, I say to you, they have received their reward. But when you give alms, do not let your left hand know what your right hand is doing, or your right is doing, so that your almsgiving may be secret, and your Father, who sees in secret, will repay you. When you pray, do not be like the hypocrites who love to stand and pray in the synagogues and on street corners so that others may see them. Amen, I say to you, they have received their reward. But when you pray, go to your inner room, close the door, and pray to your Father in secret. And your Father who sees in secret will repay you. When you fast, do not look gloomy like the hypocrites. They neglect their appearance so that they may appear to others to be fasting. Amen, I say to you, they have received the reward. But when you fast, anoint your head and wash your face so that you may not appear to be fasting except to your Father who is hidden and your Father who sees what is hidden will repay you. My dear sisters, my dear brothers, the good news of our Lord Jesus Christ. Praise to you, O Lord Jesus Christ. And your Father, who sees what is hidden, will repay you. <clears throat> Today we begin the season. Today, we begin the season of Lent. Lent <clears throat> is translated as springtime. And during springtime, we remember to clean our homes. So we are cleaning, in other words, starting today, we shall be going deep inside ourselves. And this is going to be an inner journey. It's going to be a spiritual journey. And during the spiritual journey, once in a while, we shall do spiritual battle. When I say spiritual battle, we shall kick out the things that do not belong to God and throw them away, discard them. 
and replace them with the original love that we have received from God. He is our first love and He should not be replaced with other little gods, other attachments, our favorite sins. So it's cleaning up, it's cleaning time. Today, we are given some tools. What are these tools? These tools are called self-discipline. It's called in, in Carmelite spirituality, in monastic spirituality, asasis, A-S-C-E-S-I-S, -S -E -S -S, asasis. That means spiritual discipline. That means we go back to our first love to Jesus and pray and pray in earnest from the heart. If we pray only for five minutes a day, then we shall exceed it and increase it to 10 minutes, to 15 minutes, 40 days of self-discipline or assesis. We can pray, for instance, for 30 minutes a day. That is powerful. We will be relating with God in a very intimate way with Jesus. And the Holy Spirit will give us the grace. When we feel like we're lazy, we say, Holy Spirit, come Holy Spirit. Take away this lazy bone in me. Teach me to communicate with you. To say things coming from the heart. And listen to your word. Okay, that's number one, prayer. And then we fast. Oh my goodness. If we are praying for something that is really important for us, we can couple it, <clears throat> we can marry it, meld it with what you call fasting. F-A-S-T-I-N-G. Fasting means not only with food, especially for those of us who are graying, we don't necessarily have to give up things that will keep our bodies strong. Remember that. What can we fast from? From speaking ill of others, from gossip, from cursing, from evil thoughts and acting those evil thoughts out. Those are simple things, but they are difficult to do. That is a powerful way of praying, by giving up our favorite sins. My mind is saying, raindrops and roses. And <laughs> My favorite things. Anyway, so, <laughs> after fasting, we can give up. When we give alms, we do not tell our neighbors, I have given money, I have donated something, I have done something good to the others. But we do this, why do we give alms? Because as we pray, this becomes a prayer, a vertical prayer. And then, we couple it with our prayer, horizontal prayer, together with the community as we come together during the 40 days of Lent and the Holy Week and Easter. And then we fast. Why do we fast? We give up little things like coffee and stuff. So the little savings that we do, we give to those who are in need. In other words, what I'm saying and what the Lord wants us to do is, Prove that you love me by loving your neighbor. For 40 days, we shall prove that we love Jesus and we love our neighbor. I rest my case, brothers and sisters. It is all up to us. We have to do assesis, asking the Holy Spirit to grant us the grace to have a real experience of an inner journey making God 
the center of our lives, then we can serve one another in holiness of mind, heart, and soul. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Now, we move on to the giving of God for the distribution of ashes. Dear brothers and sisters, let us humbly ask God our Father that He be pleased to bless you with the abundance of His grace these ashes which we will put on our heads in penitence. O God, who are moved by acts of humility and respond with forgiveness to works of penance, lend your merciful ear to, your, to our prayers and in, our kind, in your kindness pour out the grace of your blessing on your servants who are marked with these ashes, that as they follow the Lent of their services, they may be worthy to come with minds made pure to celebrate the Paschal mystery of your Son, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Repent and believe in the gospel. Arrepiéntete y cree en el Evangelio. 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 Repent and believe in the gospel. 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 to the liturgy of the Eucharist. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through goodness we have this bread to offer. 
which earth has given in human hands and made, it will be comforts a bread of life. Blessed be God forever. By the mystery of this water, may we come to share in the divinity of Christ, who humbled himself to share. Amen. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for to your goodness we have this wine to offer, fruit of the vine and work of human hands, and will be comforts by spiritual drink. Blessed be God forever. And the mystery of this water and wine may we come to share in the divinity of Christ, who humbled himself to share in the humanity, wash away my iniquity, cleanse me from my sin. Pray, my dear sisters, my dear brothers, and my sacrifice of yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and the glory of his name, for our good and the good of all his church. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is to be right and just and maintain our salvation at all times and everywhere to be thanks. Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God, for you will that our self-denial should give you thanks. Humble our sinful pride. Contribute to the feeding of the poor. And so help us imitate you in your kindness. And so we glorify you with countless angels as with one voice of praise we have made. Holy, 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 holy Lord, God, God of hosts, heaven and earth are full Lord of your glory. glory. Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. You are holy indeed, Mount of all holiness. Make holy their holy gifts, we pray, by sending down your spirit upon me, like the do fall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed, and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and giving thanks, broke it, and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. Until you come again. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray, partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. 
Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity together with Francis, our Pope, Robert, our Bishop, all the clergy and the religious. Remember also our brothers and sisters. We now pray for Bun and Cesario Arioso, Romel of the Villa, Jack Lambert, Brendan Dunn, Elisa Ventura, Helen Jermaine, Augie Kruger, Charles King, Virgin and Mokindo, our loved ones, friends, relatives, and benefactors who have fallen asleep in the fog of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy, welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all we pray, particularly those with cancer and those undergoing depression. That with the blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of our God, with St. Joseph, your most chaste spouse, with the blessed apostles, with St. Teresa of Avila, John of the Cross, St. Teresa of the Child Jesus, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him, with him, in him, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all the glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. Let us come before the throne of our loving Father, the throne of grace, and confidently pray. Our, our Father, Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy, thy kingdom come, thy, thy will be done, on earth, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And let us not be led into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil, and graciously grant peace in our days. By the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope in the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the, the kingdom, kingdom, the power, and the glory, and the glory are yours, now, now and, and forever. forever. Lord Jesus Christ, you said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant your peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. And may the peace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with you always. And with your spirit. There is healing when we greet one another with the peace of Jesus Christ. Peace to all of you. La paz. And we say, Lamb of God, you take, you take away the sins sin of the world. world. Have mercy on us. Lamb, Lamb of God. God you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, grant us peace. Lord Jesus Christ, with faith in your love and mercy, I eat your body and drink your blood. Let it not bring me condemnation, but help me mind and body and the healing remedy. Jesus teaches us to repent, ask forgiveness, go to confession, and believe in the teaching, his commandment, to love one another. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, Lord I, am I am not worthy, not worthy that, that you should enter into my roof, but only say the word, word and my soul, soul shall be shall healed. May the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. Keep us safe for everlasting life. Amen. Amen.
body of Christ. The body of Christ. God bless your family. Husband and wife, please come. Husband and wife. How oh, very good. Body of Christ. Body of Christ. God bless you. Some of our brothers, some of our brothers, or most of our brothers and sisters, all of our brothers and sisters who are uh, joining us online, this is a uh, video tape, so uh, we're, we're live streaming, sorry, not video tape, uh, live streaming. Some of them have not received communion, or all of them have not received communion, so we shall say the act of spiritual communion. My Jesus. I believe that you are present in the most holy sacrament. I love you above all things, and I desire to receive you into my soul. Since I cannot at this moment receive you sacramentally, come at least spiritually into my heart. I am you as if you were really there, and unite myself only to you. Never permit me to be separated from you. Amen. We pray the animal Christi. Pray for vocations, the prayer to say the name of the Archangel. Soul of Christ, sanctify me. Body of Christ, save me. Blood of Christ, liberate me. Water from the side of Christ, wash me. O good Jesus, hear me. Passion of Christ, strengthen me. Within your wounds, hide me. I am. Separated from you, let me never be. From the evil one, protect me. At the hour of my death, call me, and close to you, bid it be, that with your saints I may praise you forever and ever. Amen. Prayer for vocations. Let us ask God to give worthy priests, brothers, and sisters to his holy church. O God, we mercy to thee, to bless our diocese, many priests, brothers, and sisters, who gladly have spent their entire lives to serve thy church and to make thee known. Bless our families, bless our children. Choose from our homes those who are ready for thy life. Amen. Mary, Queen of the Clergy, pray, pray for us. us. Pray for our priests and religious. Obtain for us many more. Amen. Amen. St. Michael the Archangel, defend us in the battle. We are safeguard against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God our you can we humbly pray. And to thou, our friends of the heavenly hosts, our God, our blessed and holy self, Satan, and all the evil spirits who prowl about the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. And let us pray. May the sacrament we have received and sustain us so far. 
Father, that our Lent and fast may be pleasing to you and be for us the healing remedy through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Now, um, bow your heads and pray for God's blessing. For on the spirit of compunction, O Lord, on those who bow before your majesty, and by your mercy, may they merit the rewards you promise to those who do penance. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Amen. After this, we shall those of you who um, have died, you may want to join us for our divine prayer to our Lady of Perpetual Health. It's a Wednesday, so this is our usual way of honoring our mother. Otherwise, we may all go if you are the same. Oh, we didn't take up the collection. You may want to give alms today. We forgot. Okay, at the back of the church, you may want to go and give a little something to our church on the discipline for them. And um, just one last thing. You are bearing the cross on your foreheads, so be kind today to those who you. Be extra kind and smile. Do not frown. They will see what this cross is all about if we smile. If we frown, the cross will not make any sense at all. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. And mighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. As he said, let us go in the peace and love of Jesus Christ. Thanks be to God. Smile.